promised that my first son would be a Tobin Lee exactly like he was. And yeah, Tobin Lee Hurgis, he, he was a great man. And he's not the only one who thinks that. An entire community is mourning the loss of a well-loved business owner in Champaign. Thanks for joining us tonight. I'm McLeod Hegeman. And I'm Jessica Coons. Tobin, Toby Lee Hurgis died last week after a long battle with cancer. Today, his bar was crowded with people who came to honor his life. WCI3's Bryce Beamant is live in our newsroom. Bryce, it was an emotional gathering for people today. That's right. Family and friends had great things to say about the man who was always there for others. He never once put himself before others, even if he didn't know the person. He, he never once put himself before others, and I truly can only hope to be half of that. Dozens of people gathered at the Tumble Inn Tavern in Champaign to honor the life of the man behind the bar, Toby Lee Herges. He's impacted us four kids a lot, and especially my mom. But especially after today, seeing all these people and hearing all these stories, it's, it's very, very evident that he impacted a lot of people significantly, but in a lot of different ways. Decades ago, Hershes was diagnosed with a brain tumor. He was given just a few months to live. His wife at the time was pregnant with their first son. I have been incredibly blessed to have known him and have had him on my corner for these past 21 years when I was never supposed to know him at all. That's, that's why I don't feel robbed of anything. It's a baseball analogy. He gave it a tough at bat, okay? He grinded it out. He fouled off bad pitches, and he, he stayed up there. He didn't want to make the last out. And then finally, obviously, uh, it was just too much. Hurges was a beloved member of the community. His son says he would anonymously deliver groceries to people who he overheard saying they were struggling to make ends meet. I really do think that speaks volumes, and I can only ever hope to be as good of a man that he was and mean as much as he has. Toby was all about the, the customers, you know. He was a, he, he, he wanted them to be happy. His son says he hopes to make his dad proud. He left some damn big shoes to fill and I, I try my best and I'm trying my best and I, God knows I miss him, nor was I ready to stop learning from him, but I'm gonna do what I can to take care of things, take care of my mom. Hurges ran Tumble Inn for around 30 years. His family plans to continue running it in his memory. In the newsroom, I'm Bryce Beamett, WCIA 3, your local news leader. And his family certainly has so much support from the community. All right, Bryce, thank you.